uh, crevice? What's a crevice? Welcome to Game Wolf Plays Donkey Country 3. I feel like while I'm playing Donkey Country 3, I'm like, hmm, I could go for a cranberry soda right about now. Now that we're in the winter months. Sigh. Yeah, first mountain level, and it's in the snow world. Yeah, it's not quite snow, even though there's a few actual proper snow levels here. Yep, got more of those creeping clasps. This is this is the sequel to the Claspinators. Look, the end properly reverses when it turns around. Oh my gosh. It's supposed to do that? I don't know. I think someone may have just flipped the sprite. <laughs> don't touch them. No one knows where their feet have been. The living monstrosity of the explosive barrels. Their life is a short one, for they live on a diet of seppuku and kamikaze and harakiri. They don't like to exist, but they're going to take you with them. Collect 30 stars? That? Dancing with them? What? No. I don't know. Okay, random person who watches Dancing with the Stars. Is it actually just like stars dancing with other stars, or they're just like random contestants dancing with stars? I feel like that might be better, but I can see the problem with that. Considering, like, well, besides hygiene, I just mean, like, getting personal stuff's like, Oh, you danced with some random person live on TV. Maybe we should be in a relationship. Says E! Magazine, or what have you. It's like, God damn it, E! Slash TMZ, or whatever the fuck, get out of my face! Yeah, I'm not... Yeah, you can tell I'm definitely not in the gossip columns. And I never will be. I'm more likely to watch soap opera. But even, even then... Soap operas, aka why people don't want to do 60 frames per second on things. Like, come on. Is that really the soap opera's fault? Gosh. No. We must have things at 20 FPS. Ha 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 ha. How dare we? Uh. Sometimes I like to look around the mountain and think that there's stuff there and. Wait. What is this in the. It's like having, like, really long. I forgot what the word is when you don't quite have a stalactite or stalagmite, and it's just a long pillar of ground in your cave, but that seems to be what's going on here, except outside. This is an interesting way to work around this. Make him turn around! Yeah. Didn't think that would work, did you? That one used to give me trouble, just because I wasn't sure what exactly the physics was supposed to be doing there. Then I realized, ah oh, yes, throw it up and slow so you have time to run. Some, like I said, somehow I thought that'd be harder. It, it's not, and it doesn't matter because it's not like you die, there's no time limit. Platformers without time limits, thank the heavens. That's one thing you should be grateful for. Except for the bonuses that have time limits. That, But that's necessitated by how they work. Let's go over here. This might be a bonus you miss, but you go up above the end and whoop! There we go, it's a bonus. How do I know that was the only tr the only hint is just like hmm maybe the bananas go somewhere instead of just being right there but that's really your only hint and it's not immediately obvious I know I've missed that bonus before. In the past I like to blast from the past blast from the past and I do these rope things and I got rope burn on my free huge freaking hands and I go right and you go left and I go wherever I want. Really? Yes. Ah, uh, ah! After a thousand years, I'm finally free. Okay, going up the rope with my hands, vertical rope and sideways rope. It's a carryover from Donkey Kong Country 2. All these fucking riggings, you know. No more vines, though. We can't be having that. No vines in our Donkey Kong countries. How dare you! It's kind of satisfying watching Kitty's hands go, like, one in front of the other when he's going to the side or going up and down. I don't know why. Something mesmerizing about his hands. Okay, pick that shit up. Raise your flag with honor! Or maybe I'm using my shorts. Of course. There's a cave inside a cave. Wow. I, again, 
I'm sure there's a knitting simulator for you. You just have to look around the internet. I mean, the closest thing I think of without actually knitting would be like, what? When I, I don't know, man. Play some like Katamari Damashi or something. Or some shit. I don't know. Cranky has a lot of disposable income he saved up over the years, so he can do whatever he wants. I'm not sure how this currency works. Maybe it's maybe the bear coins are a lot like the Canadian dollars. I, I don't know. I, I, it's just because of the setting. Um, the fact it's a big old mountain. Yeah, that's you know I don't think angels in North America. By the way, whatever. I, I think that's more like something near the Swiss Alps. I don't know. I don't know. Is it North America? Is it Europe? Who really cares? I guess I shouldn't. Aha! Required team-up challenge. Donkey Kong Country 2 had one of those too, except it was in a bonus world level thing. And it resulted in a DK coin. Although I kind of prefer the coins being hidden, I do like the fact it's like, well, you found it, but now you gotta earn it. This is the Tear away toboggan. If you remember that pipe level, well, now you're in the snow. Yep. Oh yeah, and the skidders are back. Just for this, I, I guess they would only be in the snow levels anyway. Uh, is that why they're purple? I don't know. Guys, do you know any purple reptiles? Like I know the shiny Kecleon is purple. I mean actual purple reptiles. They exist, right? Like I'm thinking more of like maybe frogs would be different colors because I know frogs to be colorful, but. I'm talking just straight up, like obviously there's green and brown reptiles, yes, but are there freaking purple reptiles? Do they exist? Let me know in the comments below, except you never type shit down there anyway. <laughs> no, tell me in person. One day we'll talk about this and be like, what the fuck do you mean by purple reptiles? Like, yeah, you mentioned it like a thousand years ago on Dong Kong Country 3 and I'm just like, oh, alright, well tell me more, assuming I remember. And we'll have a good laugh with a friend. Look, she's so thrilled to be in the driver's seat. Woohoo! But how is it jumping? Ah, don't think about it too much. Think about the snow. Think about how it fills you with a winter like vision. Okay, there we go. It's a little tough to get in. It was more like, yeah, I remembered where it was, but not remembering how to get in there because shit happens fast, you know. Collect 50 freaking stars. Do it now. Do it now. Uh-oh. You better follow the stars exactly, because you're not going to get a second chance. Oh, shit. That's not too bad. I do like, because of the palette swap of the snow levels, the snowman gets a different scarf color. And the sky looks different, too. That's funny. <laughs> it wasn't even something that needed to be done, but hey, since we're not changing the snow color, I guess we'll just change the sky. Gosh, I see skies of purple. Cannot rhyme that. I think there might have been something up there which I'd need a team jump to, and I say, what a wonderful country. Yes, very wonderful. Barrel drop bounce. Hey, hey guess what? It's a waterfall level. Haha, <laughs> out in the ice world? I know, big surprise. Totally unfitting. Also, this level can be terrible if you don't know how to deal with these things. So, I don't think you can jump on the back, but yeah. Others will keep coming down, and you just have to keep jumping steadily and quickly. Otherwise, it's going to take you forever to climb this shit, and you're going to be feel, feeling stupid in the morning. If I see where I'm freaking going, I believe something's over there, but I'm going to have to go up higher, because you jump off of there, shit. But yeah, coin right near the start of level. That's what I'm talking about. What are you talking about? I don't know. All these things. They're made for talking about and all that shit. Is my face close enough to the mic? Yes! Shut it! I remember back in the day when I used a headset as a mic, but it was like those little earbud things and somehow it worked because magic. <laughs> it shouldn't have worked, but it did. It was beautiful. I was like, the speaker is the mic. Oh my god, you know. And the other way around. Sometimes my OS is like, this mic can be a speaker. I'm like, uh, no. 
That's what I say. This, the colors of this level make me think of salmon. I like, I like, I like fish. Considering the prices of meat lately, all of a sudden, I've had to resort to fish. <laughs> I know what you're saying, but where's all the people giving? It's like everyone's having problems, so it's like, I know we can't all agree on, you know, getting freaking food. You know, that, that you want like people to. You want people to be pissed off? Change the price of food really quickly. You're gonna get a fight on your damn hands. I'm serious. At least I hope so. Yeah, the, the moment people run out of food, it's like, well, I got nothing to lose. So, yeah. Short sightedness mostly. Jump in the barrels, jumping on the barrels with your very best friend. Is he your friend? I don't really know. But as you jump up barrels left to right, you will have to tell me more. And you go out to the left, take that Japan. We're going to the left, just like in your manga. Manga. Manga stuff in Korea, it's called manhwa. But that means I don't know what Korean anime is supposed to be, sound like, so, okay. I'm sure there's such a thing. I also like that, um, Korea has DOS games. I think I mentioned this before, but I'd really like someone to sit down and translate some of these. There's a lot of market for translating JRPGs. We can't get enough of that. In fact, it happens so much, some people do it more than once, because people do it weird the first time. For some reason. Just add in their own shit. Whatever. But no, um... I'm, I'm hoping there's some, like, bilingual person that's in the Korea and England, and is like... Okay, I'm going to translate these DOS games. But then they also need someone that's an expert in DOS, so I mean, like... Yeah. I feel like this is something I'd get behind. So, if if we need another batch of DOS games, let's, 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 let's work together with South Korea and see what we can do. My grandfather didn't die for this shit! Find the freaking coin! Okay. I mean, I do what you tell me to, game. I do it all night long. Because I am subservient. I am just like an automatic machine. A robot that plays video games. And I jump up the barrels left and right. And I jump up the barrels left and right. Getting the coin. Yes. It seems like the best kind of LP the LPs are the ones where I improvise. Because I don't have time to second guess what I'm saying. Until after the fact. Sometimes it's more me, it's like, uh oh, foot in the mouth! <laughs> but th this is good. I get to actually do stuff and not question every single fucking thing I'm doing. That's kind of what happened last night. I was just like, oh crap. I can do technically better. It's like, stop! You're doing fine! It's just like, I don't believe you! So I'm the one who sees the shit I do in the background and sees what I could be doing. It's it's Parry, the parallel parakeet. It says parallel bird, but it's clearly a parakeet. You guys own any parakeets? They're pretty cheap, you know, and you can get and you should always have at least a handful of them because they like being in colonies. Yeah. Oh man. That, that, oh shit, I just realized something horrible. Considering the price of food now, how is pet food gonna go? That's not good. That's really not good. And it's accidentally died. I think there might have been, like, uh, probably another three up or something. Anyway, it, it's not actually necessary, but in the future, I'm gonna need to keep Perry with me. Okay? So practice your parallelogram, bird, alright? No rhombus, no rhomboid, just the parallelogram. You got it? No trapezoids, only crack and crocodile, according to this level name. <laughs> but it's factory, so you got you can get behind that with all your factory nonsensicalness. See you next time.